he's about to poop in public. And I don't have a bag to pick it up. I have a donut bag. No, that'll break. Ah! Uh, come get that. We're coming to get it. We'll be back. You watch. And this is why we video ourselves. Because it's really the mindset that changes life. It's not like the practical tips. That's the biggest thing from this video blog is that's not the practical tips. Oh. Sit. Look at this. Albus doesn't care about it. Oh. Who are we going to pay it forward to, Albus? Who are we going to pay it forward to? It's our first video blog. We found $20. We found $20 and we got a surprise. And we're going to go pick up our poop. It happens. Sometimes it happens four times in the morning. And you just gotta go back and pick it up. More trash. Let's pick that up too. This episode is gonna be called Picking Up the Shit. <laughs> and find that I found $20. <laughs> episode number one. gotta talk about your poop. Poop's important. Look at the Bristol scale. You need to poop every day if you can. No, I'm just saying like, it's good to poop every one to two days and it's best if you can poop at least once a day. Is this thing is pooping too much? There is too much poop. The irony of my sister giving me a travel calendar in 2020 <laughs> didn't happen. Didn't happen. Later that night. Ready for this? We're gonna go pick up some poop. It's gonna get real up in here. It's poop time. Everybody poop time. Everybody, everybody poop time. Cool thing is this jacket has like some sweet designs inside of it. Super cool. Let's get going. I'm gonna take out the Ducati, the Devil, the Diablo, the 1260S. It's a bad machine, and it is loud, and you're gonna hear it. It's super loud. So what's crazy is the Ducati, when I turned it back on for the first time in a month, told me on the dash it was 29 days since I last rode it. Sorry Ducati, you deserve a little better. Alright, let's get going. Here's the poop. <laughs> we have found the poop. The poop is here. We have found the poop. It's cleanup time. With the poop. Success!
I went to Brothers K, which is a local coffee shop in Evanston, to go get a reward donut and treat for myself to enjoy the morning and a nice decaf coffee and donut. And on the way there, Albus pooped one too many times. That was my shit for the day. And the general consensus of the day was about dealing with your poop that you haven't dealt with in your life. So a lot of times patients come to me and they basically say, well, why is this thing that happened to me 5, 10, 30 years ago still a problem for me? How could that possibly be affecting me? It's kind of like, well, if you had major trauma, emotional, physical, inflammatory infections that you didn't deal with, like a root canal that's still bothering you, what that's basically telling me is that sometimes there was some poop or some problems that you had in your past part of your life that you just haven't fully picked up and dealt with yet. And that's part of what we do in healthcare is just help people with their poop and their problems. On my day, I had three bags to pick up Albus's poop and he actually pooped four times. So sometimes life throws you more things than you can handle at one time. Maybe you were too busy at that time in your life to deal with your trauma. Whatever it was, you didn't have enough bags or enough time to pick up the poop that you had in your life. I'm the doctor who picks up your poop for you. Buns are here. The buns are here.